couldn't figure it out. I was exhausted all the time. I was just feeling so hopeless. I didn't even want to go to the gym anymore. I can't remember the last time I got a good night's sleep. I noticed I was starting to pack on some extra pounds too. And I also had this discomfort in my back. I just didn't feel like doing the things I usually enjoy. After several weeks of this, I decided to make an appointment with my doctor. Major Depressive Disorder, or MDD, affects people's lives in many different ways. In MDD, there are at least five symptoms of depression that must be present during the same two-week period, with at least one of the symptoms being diminished interest and pleasure or depressed mood. The symptoms of MDD that are related to your physical health can include a lack of energy or feeling fatigue, decrease in movement or speech, feeling restless or unable to sit still, and fluctuation in weight. Some individuals also experience associated symptoms like unexplained pain, headaches, cramps, or digestive problems. During my initial exam of Jamal, I asked him some questions I could tell he wasn't expecting, regarding his mood or his ability to focus and remember things. I told him he was likely experiencing major depressive disorder or MDD. I explained that his physical symptoms were common to have with MDD and the relationship between physical symptoms and depression can be hard to untangle. I recommended a therapist who specialized in treating depression, and I also gave him some tips to help initially with his symptoms. At first I was embarrassed about going to therapy, but I finally talked to a close friend in my family about it, and they were so supportive and encouraging that it actually made me feel better. There are several steps that may help you address the physical symptoms that you are experiencing. See your doctor. It's important to first rule out other health problems that could be causing physical symptoms. Share the whole picture with your doctor about your physical, mental and emotional symptoms. Once you have been diagnosed, mental health professionals can help treat mental and emotional symptoms. Make a plan and stick to it. There are many things you can do, but you'll need the support of friends and family too. Set realistic goals, stay active and ask for help when you need it. Do your research and keep learning and always make sure you communicate openly and honestly with your doctor and other healthcare professionals. Staying on your treatment journey from MDD takes a lot of work, but it's so important to stay positive and keep working toward treatment goals. Since using some of the tips my doctor recommended, I have begun to feel better physically, which has made it easier to focus on treating the other symptoms of my MDD. I go to the gym once a week and make time for my friends. <laughs> 